Hey guys, welcome back to the Harma channel and thank you for watching and if you're new to this, can you please subscribe and leave me any comment. Today we'll be talking about the first 90 days in the business, the expenses that goes in the 90 days and how do I help you get one transaction, at least one. Stay tuned and I'll be right back. So let's talk about the first 90 days. Do you really have to have a lot of money to start real estate? How much does it cost you and how do you get into one transaction? Which is pretty exciting, you know, because real estate is really fun. Number one, you need business cards. Business cards should not cost you more than $40 to get a 1,000. That's a lot, by the way. You need 1,000 business cards. Number two, you need to become a board member. Why? Because you have to call yourself realtor. You can't call yourself realtor until a board member and you have to have an MLS membership. So you can actually search MLS and you can show the properties. Number three, you have to get a good broker. What do I mean by that? The broker, it's very important. They can break your career like in a minute or they can build you up. Don't just jump in on the first broker you made or someone who referred. You gotta interview others and make sure you pick the right person that is a match with your mindset and your goals. Number four, you need a mentor. Mentor is not just a broker. Mentor is someone that you shadow, you learn from, they're active, and they will push you to become better at what you do. I have another video on that. I have the link below so you can actually watch and pick the right mentor. And number five, you don't need expensive clothes. You don't need the most expensive car. What you need, it's a nice, reliable car with the clothes that are washed and professional. You can just have two suits and wash them often. Don't need a nice, expensive watch. You don't need the most expensive car. You just have to make sure they're clean because when the client sees you, they're not gonna care about what kind of car you're driving. They will care about your knowledge. They will care about how much you care for them. As I always say, they don't care how much you know until they know how much you care. So remember, you don't need more than $1,000 to start a real estate career. You just need to be proactive, coachable, and care for the clients. And if you don't have $1,000 to start, I don't think you should jump in real estate. Real estate is not for you. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure you leave a comment. I'll respond to every comment out there and make sure you subscribe.